Hello fish guys, what's up? How are you? How is everything? Guys, this is my planted aquarium and you know that it is about 120 gallons and this is a tropical fish tank and you can see the fishes are doing well and the plants are also well but there are some problem with the, with the plants and I show you for example we have sunset and you can see some of the leaves have got some holes and same is the case with the rotella and some other plants guys actually i was not dosing the fertilizers properly because i ran out the micro fertilizers and i was only dosing the macro fertilizers and the micro fertilizers are very important and sometimes we do not think that but without micro fertilizers or micronutrients the plants may show the sign of deficiency issue so you must have to feed the plants the micronutrients also so we have talked about the macro and micronutrients in my previous video i will give you the link in the description so today we are gonna focus only on the micronutrients and i will tell you what are the micronutrients and we are going to prepare the diy fertilizer of the micronutrients and i will show you that how to prepare and how to calculate the amount of the fertilizer we are gonna learn everything in this video so guys stay tuned and please subscribe if you haven't so let's move ahead so what are the micronutrients these nutrients are basically required in very small quantity but these are very essential and if you don't provide these then your plants may show the symptom of deficiency and what are those for example, we have iron, boron, molybdenum, zinc, copper. These are the micronutrients and you must have to provide for the proper growth of the plants. Okay guys, now I'm going to tell you that how to calculate the amount of the salt that is CSM plus B. This is the website or we have got the nutrient dosing zinc calculator and I will share the link of this website in the description so now we are going to calculate the amount of salt which we are required for 500 ml micro solution so we have the size of the aquarium 115 gallons here we have added 115 US gallons and now it is asking that the fertilizers are premixed or DIY so we are gonna make the DIY fertilizers so we will select DIY option and now it is asking the compound which we are gonna use so here we have different compounds so we are going to select CSM chelated secondary micronutrients and here we have selected it and now we are going to select a solution and now it is asking the container size basically it is the size in which we are going to mix up the salt so we have the capacity of 500 ml so we have entered 500 and now it is asking the dosing size and we are going to add 20 ml each time so here we are going to add 20 and now calculating estimated index and round to the digit pass decimal auto and now we are going to calculate so we have to press the calculate and let's see what it says it says that we have to add 25.6 grams of the CSM to reach the required quantity of the micronutrients or it is equivalent to 1 tablespoon plus 2 tablespoon plus half TB and guys this is the amount if, if you are calculating in the form of the tablespoon and teaspoon and these are the quantity of the elements we have iron 0.2 ppm per degree boron magnesium molybdenum zinc and copper these all are the micronutrients so it also says that you have to add two to four times a week for good results so in this way you can calculate the amount of the damage of your salt so guys now we are going to make the micro fertilizers 
as we have calculated the amount of CSM and here we have got the calculated grammage of the CSM and I will give you the link for buying the CSM and here we have got the 500 ml bottle and the most important thing guys this is the distilled water which we are gonna use or it is called the battery water also 100% distilled water we are going to use this water for making the fertilizer and if you use the tap water then the salt may not get dissolved properly so you have to use the distilled water to make it effective so we are gonna dissolve this So guys now we are gonna dose the micro fertilizer and we are going to add 20 ml so we have to push four to five times and you must have to dose twice a week for the proper results so this was today's video and thank you for watching bye bye